And if she'd stayed, she could have been terrific with, mm. you know, with so many of the things that She's... she could have done. But she couldn't wait. She's very impatient. She has to win. The same way with her new website. And what is it called? American Riviera Orchard, where she's going to tell us... Is that what she's called, the website? That's the website. Oh, that long... Oh, how stupid is that? <laughs> American Riviera... What if you spell, you spell something wrong, it won't go... What's she thinking? <laughs> well, I, I tried to put it together to Amer see if the American, first word... American Riviera, what? The, I thought if the first word of each word would make some sort of clever word... No, it's it would not be, But clever. it's not, it's not. But this is about selling jam, selling tablecloths, all that. But it was just... There's on. a Britishness to it, though. She's trying to be at a bit of... Jam. I'm no, surprised she should be selling scones. Be, she's got to be in the limelight. So, but what's very interesting is that that page is only one page. You can't buy anything. You can't see what's really mm. coming up. There's a little list, and you join it. Um, and that's really, really interesting because she took away Prince Harry's spotlight on the day that it was his mother's um, re reward um, charity. Yeah, yeah. I guess that. He he. He loves his mother and he still thinks they're connected with the heavens. And, um, Do you think he's... I feel like he's sort of replaced her, the mother kind of thing and put Megan there in a way and she's kind of... Well, he thinks um, Dana would have adored Meg and they'd have been best friends, so I don't think that's well, she quite might have done. right. She might have but, done. but I think that, um, actually, to spoil it for your husband to take the limelight from him when she could have done it the next day, a week later, or months later when the whole thing's ready, I think is beyond cruel.